strange. Overlord Zenon, my master, I have just received urgent news from the princess's mansion. The princess has disappeared, and it has happened in front of many servants. What? Is this true? It appears someone has summoned her. Someone with decent summoning skill. But who? How did they even know about the princess? We do not know yet. But it is obviously someone who opposes you. Find the princess. Immediately. You must not allow her to be contaminated by the outside world. Yes, sir. We will be sure to keep the princess a secret from anyone else. What shall you have us do with the guards at her mansion? Wipe them out. All of them. As you wish, my master. Welcome back, Adele. The item world! Oh god, the item world. Terror. Get more than other world that exists within an item. It's foreign for strengthening your items, but it may be risky for a beginner like her. Infinite fool, I am no beginner. See the beginner. And as we saw in the cutscene, apparently the bad people now know that we have Rosalind. And actually, I'm not gonna try to go in there yet because I know I'm gonna get my ass handed to me. No one's nowhere near high enough level. No cut field, no cutscene this time though. Aww. More geo panels. Uh, XP plus. Ah, oh, there's the treasure. There's the treasure. I want to get it, but I, I can't get over there fast enough. In order to acquire treasures in this game, you gotta. Get up here and whack them. If you if you're the one to break it, you get the item. So since I can't do that, I'm just gonna start with something standard. I'm gonna make this a mini li little level up area. Keep messing. Let's get Rosalind to just draw it over here and end it. Fighting a moth. And there's my <coughs> chest. Well, actually, hold on. The sound effect actually was for. Oh, no. oh well. It's got 10 HP left. Come on, Prinny, you can do it. Come on, Prinny. Come on. That's just. No! You better lift, Prinny, goddammit. I can't lift up and throw you away, because you explode. <coughs> the sound effects are really loud for me. I'm not sure if it actually is that or going to the video. Eh, huh, not sure, but... Prinny! Kill! Yay, Prinny leveled up twice, and oh my god, his HP. Medic! <laughs> Let me see. I actually, I was, I was thinking of what to talk about during moments like this where there is sort of nothing much to talk about except for things that a lot of you guys can see and... I forgot what I was gonna say and... Oh, we have a tri-burst now. Let's see. Let's see what this looks like. Just three bullets. Huh? Good, I guess. And he is almost dead. I kind of want to let the printy kill it. Oh, he could reach it too. Printy, attack! Was that yeah, it was. Awesome, printy is awesome. And we'll, uh, might as well bring Adele out just in case something goes wrong. Better to have him around rather than dispatch him later and just... Mm. Bad news. And have her keep healing people. That's her job. 
Yeah, that's actually loud for me. Strange. Attack! Don't kill it. Brenny, clean up! Ah! Oh. oh, that's that's mean. That. Oh. See, can I? Target height problem. Damn. So unfortunately, the printy's gonna have to stay out of this for a bit. Oh God, no! Don't attack the printy. Can I not? I cannot. Ah, oh, God. You know what? No, you're coming now. The healer's not going to the front lines. And what? He's right there. Just ah. Ah, this is just distasteful. Oh god, Rosalind's gonna get... Missed. Prinny! Oh, at least the Prinny's almost dead. Or, I mean, the orc. Fidel, yeah. Oh. Random, but it just hit me. I remember one of my friends asking me how I got into this Gaia. And I don't remember telling anyone so far, especially in the video, so... How I got into this Gaia was... One day I went over to my, one of my friend's house, and... He was just playing the game. I saw it... It looked pretty aw very awesome, I'm not gonna lie. It just looked really appealing. Except he was playing in one of the later levels where... You could... Do over six digit damage. And it scared me. I'm not lying, it scared me. Oh, <laughs> counter. And after I saw that, I just... I had to figure out about it. I went out to GameStop, I got the first game, and... Sort of just fell in love with this within a matter of moments. <laughs> and that was too short of a thing to actually answer, so... Ah! There's nothing to... I hate this. <laughs> Let me see. I want to. I want to use Pretty Barrage. I'm gonna use it. Oh, I can't. Yes. Ready, dude. Yeah. Awesome. Pretty is awesome. We got ramen and another tunic and 172 health. That's not bad. Listen, you. Why do you desire to do something as stupid and reckless as battling my father? Do you actually believe you, a mere human, stand a chance against my father? Xenon's curse turned every human into a monster. He turned our beautiful world into some twisted netherworld. When humans turn into monsters, they start to lose their conscience and memories, eventually becoming real monsters. I grew up watching as my family slowly turned into monsters. Can you even imagine how painful that is? If my family becomes something truly monstrous, I won't let that happen. I will defeat Xenon! I'll do whatever it takes to protect my family! You may talk all you want, but do you honestly believe that? You won't even take any hostages, correct? Uh, there's no doubt I'll defeat him! Yes, yes, you've declared that many times. But where does all your confidence come from? Tell me! Look at me! I'm the only one in Veldheim who hasn't turned into a monster, and I still have all my memories and morals. I'm the only human who hasn't been affected by Xenon's curse. That has to mean something. And? That's it. That's it? Your faith in defeating Overlord Xenon is solely based on that? Why? Is there a problem with that? It 
is more than just a problem. Are you so stupid you do not see it? Do you not have a better reason? Such as being from a heroic lineage or being level 100 million? Normal people usually have, you know, real reasons to believe they can defeat their enemies. Huh, I don't care. Not having a good reason to fight is just an excuse for people who don't want to fight. I suppose you may be correct, but... What's really important is to never give up, to have an indomitable will. Even if your legs are broken and your arms fall off, you have to fight to the end. That's just my style. A speech on willpower in this day and age? I did not know people still believed in such silly notions. Perhaps it was your thick skull that prevented my father's curse from affecting you. To be summoned by such an odd peasant, I must be cursed with the worst of luck. This human is a complete fool. Such a cretin must not be allowed to disturb my father. I shall have to kill him myself. Be prepared. I guess now we know a bit more of where Adele's coming from. Why well, he wants to kill the bad dude, I already forgot his name. Zenon, that's the name, Zenon. And that he's an idiot. We kind of sort of knew that, though. So. Heal ourselves up, and we're gonna move on. Yep. Okay. Let me see, how much mana does actually everyone have right now? Or can I check that right here? Oh no, stats. Seven, three, zero, one, two, seven. Woo! We only got 132 health, so I sort of don't want to waste much of that. Actually, let's... Hold on, if I remember correctly, aren't there supposed to be... Um... Bear with me for a second, I know there's supposed to be something. I just... I'm very... I'm being excruciatingly descriptive on something. I remember there being chests or something around here. Just can't... Oh, it's the moth beard. Oh well. I guess not at this point. Foreshadowing. <laughs> not spoilers. Foreshadowing. Actually, before we do anything else, I'm gonna save right here. Who knows what's gonna happen, and these don't exist, remember? Do not exist. And in honesty, I kind of forgot a lot of what was done in those... in these save files, just because it was so long ago. <laughs> so, let's see what, what's, what's on for us next. Town fields. The dead tree field. Let's go.